Hello and welcome to Impel's uh, sales automation demo. Impel CRM covers a lot of functions including marketing, distributor management, dealer management, coupons, loyalty, you name it. We're not going to go into all those details. We're going to focus exclusively on sales automation in this particular demo. In sales automation, using sales automation, you can do a variety of things. Shortening sales cycles, improving sales operations, improving price realizations, marketing effectiveness, sharpening the brand in the mind of the consumer, and overall connecting with your customer or consumer much, much better. That's what sales automation can do. And a typical sales automation system has a bunch of things. It has lead management, where leads could come in from a variety of sources. It has contact management, which are people. It has accounts, which are companies, opportunities, and a bunch of other things. What are those other things? What are the typical things that you will see in sales operations? Here are a bunch of objects. Leads. Leads are usually like business cards. In a business to business situation, you collect business cards. That business card has the name of a person, designation, um, company name, details of the company, and some understanding of what your conversation was with that person. That's what a lead is. When that lead gets processed, when you talk to that lead, talk to that person, make up your mind that, hey, this makes sense for my company. He's interested in buying something from my company. You go out and do a conversion. And that conversion splits that lead into three things. Into an account, which is the company that gentleman worked for, the contact, which is that gentleman's details, and an opportunity to sell him whatever you are selling. Now, in a business to consumer situation, the account may be irrelevant, may not be used. That's okay in Impel because Impel is very good for B2C too, for getting just their leads directly into Impel, which come in as leads and get converted into contacts and opportunities. So you could do a variety of things. And as you talk to that gentleman, talk to what product he's interested in, set up meetings with him, do specific tasks to make this sale happen, all of those things can be recorded in the system. And as you talk to him multiple times, you go through a process of selling, which is the stages of selling. Let's see how you would do that. Out here is our lead list. There's already a particular lead, right? I spoke to Rakesh Padnaban. I go out and do an appointment. There's Rakesh Padnaban's basic information, okay? And I say, uh, called him. Uh, he said to call back on Monday, right? So it, it was a phone call, so I will choose phone call and uh, sh I will make a note that I should call him uh, before, let's say, 12 o'clock, right? And this happened at 6.03 p.m., whatever. It, it didn't take one hour, but let's not waste time on that. I'll just go add and move on. If you look at that ad here, I just added an activity. It shows that activity right there. When I click on that, it shows whatever I just keyed in. Very simple very straightforward. That's my lead. Now that lead, when I convert, gets converted to one of those stages that I talked about. In this organization, we have set up a bunch of stages. Qualified lead is the first stage, then it becomes a prospect, then there's an inquiry, then there's quote submitted, then maybe a price request, then we know that they're actively considering our product, they have internal discussions, there's a negotiation, there's a customer. Typically, there aren't so many stages. Typically, you will have four or five stages depending on your business process. But that's okay. Let's go over this and then say, hey, let's go convert. We can assign to somebody, by the way. It's currently assigned to Karthik Dharmarajan, as you see right here, right? But let's just go out and do a convert. When we convert, it comes and says, do you want to convert this to qualified lead? I say, yes. I go convert that. I go view that opportunity the one that just got converted. There is Rakesh Padmaban. The company is AM Motors. And there's one contact. That's what we spoke to. And the one call that I made. Everything is recorded in there, right? This is a custom field that this particular company has. You know, there are custom fields. Let's not waste too much time working on all of those things right now. Here's the opportunity. I can go back to a list of opportunities, look at just opportunities. I can look at contacts view contacts. For example, this is a contact that we talked to earlier, you know, Anush Srivastava. And here are the activities that we had, here are the opportunities we had. These are all tied together. And the gentleman we just converted, you know, um, Rakesh Padnaban, here is his information. All of this information is available. Incidentally, 
one of the key things about Impel is not just phone calls and things like that, but mail. Email is connected. If you look at this particular inbox, this is the inbox on my server. I've configured it to download it, show me emails. For example, one of these people I know sent me an email. There is, I don't know why he sent me, hey, here's the information. I know that his middle name is Kishore. So I will convert, I'll change it right there, right? It gets saved. This has to be edited, that's okay. Now, here is some interesting stuff. I've got this email, I can go back, because I already know the contact, I can add this as another lead, I can add this as a ticket, or I can link it to some other stuff that already exists. I know it's linked to an opportunity already, because I did it last time. Let's pick another one, let's say Bharat. This is an email from a gentleman called Bharat Narayan. Now this particular email is probably not connected anywhere. Let's go link. This particular email, I will say, is actually tied to an account. When I do star star, it shows me a bunch of accounts. It's tied to, I don't know, ABC company. Right? I update that. Now, when I go look at ABC company, right here, right? let's go back there and look for ABC company. Here is ABC company. It's a shipper in the automotive business. I look at that and look at uh, activities out there five activities invitation to connect from Bharat is there so you see my email is now connected to my complete CRM solution so as an integrated solution pretty much every CRM solution will have similar things leads contacts opportunities things like that what's different about Impel is its integration with email its integration with SMS for example I could go here I could if I if the user if the contact I have has an SMS number mobile number I can pick and send an email right there I can set up templates which will pick it up fill it out so on and so forth so variety of integration capabilities there there are lots of other things that we do in Impel to begin with is sales automation I hope this has helped thank you